I'm sorry. Hi. It's such an odd mark. Look, what are you doing? You're walking around. Oh, Hello, well. Geraldine. Oh, look. Sit down, Geraldine. Sorry, sorry about Sit that. Sit down. Why don't you come and Very sit unprofessional. Very unprofessional. Lovely. Hello, how are you? Come here. Come here and give me a big kiss. I'm going to give you a hug. Look at you. How are you? Oh. Fabulous. Lovely top, Happy Christmas. Very nice. Happy Christmas, Andrew. Thank you. Happy Christmas to you. How are you, Geraldine? Fine. And you. You must be so pleased. I'm so tired. Sad. I haven't been to bed yet. Well, you really? Really? There, Where am I sitting? Just Why, there. Well, tell Sorry, me what, you make yourself comfortable. We've got to talk to Colour Munna. I know you're a big fan of Colour Munna. She's oh. our LA correspondent. We're going to go and get a little oh, bit of on, gossip from hello. Hollywood. Hello. Yes. Hello. Hello. Lovely. Hello. I think you might hello. have similar hairdressers. I'm not no sure. No idea but... who I am. Good morning, <laughs> Carla. <laughs> Of course, I watch I good, want morning. good morning, Kate. Good morning, Andrew. Good morning, Britain. Good morning. <laughs> think I'm from we Britain. are live from Hollywood. <laughs> she, she thinks I'm from she Britain. She doesn't think I'm from Britain. It's fine. She said hello, Britain. Oh. Golden Globe nominations unveiled. Kate Winslet, tell us about the hat. Got Geraldine McQueen with us. Would you fancy a bit of a spread like that? A bit of a what? A bit of <laughs> <laughs> doing a lovely sort of half naked shoot with a tie. Why strategic. not? I'd love to do something like that. It'd be incredible. Okay. Would you? Yeah. I would. I, would. Okay. I saw you breastfeeding the goat. One of the <laughs> what was all that about? Yeah. That, that was that a serious Reece. documentary. All right. Anyway. And that, <laughs> that is recent, <laughs> I have to say. That, 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 that Listen, is recent. explain what's going on, Mr. Exactly. Carl. What's oh, going God. on, Andrew? Look, the expert... you know, he just turned to me and said, nice balls. On, on here. And I said, not anymore. Well, you, 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 you just said that the tree coughed. It's all been very confusing in here this it morning. It is, it is indeed. Um, you're expected to have the Christmas number one. Do you find that um, a, a pressure? What's, what's the song going to be called? It's called Once Upon a Christmas Song. Yes. And it was written by myself and Gary Barlow. We, Gary Barlow, who's, who's going to be sitting here. Yes. Or where is it? Is he here or is he over there? Where is he sitting? We're he's over, going to be performing over, over there. there. They're all in the yeah. canteen now, take that, getting some... Uh, Thanks to the vending machine. Is well, it the real Gary Barlow that wrote it? The real it? Gary Barlow. Not just a Gary Barlow. No, the one from Take That. Yes. Really? Yes. And he's doing it. Really? He wrote the song with me, and it's for the NSPCC. There's no finer charity at Christmas than that. No. Indeed. And you came through to our attention, first thrust to fame, thrust. through this incredible reality show. What's it called again? Britain's Got the Pop Factor and possibly a new celebrity, Jesus Christ, soap star, superstar, Strictly on Ice. <laughs> and Brilliant. I, and I was the winner of that. That was an amazing night. And who did you beat in the final of that? Our show, win. Yeah? Yes. And two up, two down. Really? <laughs> and I won that night. Unbelievable. And now look at me, it's been non -stop. I haven't been to bed. Is it a dream come night. true? Is it a dream come true, Joe? It's a dream come true. Yeah, but but you've got to have a dream. Society. If you don't have a dream, Andrew, how are you going to have a dream come true? You've got to have a dream and you've got to have a video That's as well. That's what Martin Luther King said. Yes. Mm. That's I was either him or South Pacific. I can't remember. <laughs> Something like that. Let's, Should we have a look? There's a video to go with. Let's this, have a look at the video story. now. <laughs> no expense, but oh, sorry. <laughs> drop out of drop, drop, drop out of the voice then. <laughs> it catch me off guard. <laughs> I went back to being who I used to be. This time last year, Andrew, I was in Bangkok. Were well, you? I thought I'd never. I thought I'd never walk again, let alone sing. <laughs> right. And, and then oh, you were on your way to Lapland there. In there the, at Lapland. In the Come on, do it. Do the actions. Come on. What do we do then? Over and over. No, no, no. Over and over and over again, <laughs> over and over <laughs> and over. It's very easy to it's, learn. It's that's a good one. That, that's learn. the entire routine, yeah. isn't it's it? Fanta it's a lovely catchy song. It's about time we had a good Christmas song. The last good Christmas song we had was Mad World. So it's about time we had a good one. Cliff Richard came up with a few over the over the over the time. Didn't no, it? But that was that was after. Hers in my mouth. See, I've heard though, Jordan, that you've made Simon Cowell very cross. Simon Simon Cowell is the Grinch who stole the Christmas single. And Geraldine McQueen's stealing it back. It's about time people had a but laugh. But he's got a serious reality show which he's trying to promote and a serious winner. But, but and Britain's got the pop factor and possibly new celebrities. It was just serious too. <laughs> serious too. And, and it's important. You know, we should have a laugh at Christmas. Christmas is a fantastic time. We should have it every year. And what was the Royal Variety performance like? You, um, you, you, you must have been absolutely um, delighted. To, are you Captain right Caveman here. Can we, can we <laughs> go get, on. Can you know, we people don't on. know the perils of long hair and lip I don't know what you have to go through. You don't, don't know what we have to suffer. You're lucky. Yeah. Can we see the teeth? Yeah, that's fine. There's oh, my own teeth. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. There's my own teeth. Go on now, you were saying. <laughs> no, I was just saying the Royal Variety performance. I did the Royal Variety last night. Tell us night. about that. Unbelievable. Who was there? Met Camilla and Charles. And what did they make of you? I, I actually got to meet Charles like this. Did a wee curtsy. Did said you? Said hello at the end. It was, I think it just messed with his mind. I don't think he knew what was going on there. But it went very well. We sang that they were all doing the actions over and over. Well, not Charles and, and Camilla as well. They were in the box, yes. <gasps> I made That's them do brilliant. it. They were all doing it. Fantastic. That's like Royal Seal of the NSPCC. Yes. Yes. You've got to do it. 
Okay, so we can all look stupid for charity, is that the principle? Well, it's for a good cause. Yes. If you're going to do it, do it okay. for an important reason. Don't be cynical. What's the matter I'm with you? I'm not being cynical. Time. Okay, come on. So, <laughs> will you be going home for, uh, for, for Christmas and spending it with family? I live in London now. Okay. I live in London. I don't actually, I've got just bought a 34-storey one-bedroom apartment. <laughs> and I don't touch anything. I'm not allowed to touch anything. Since I won the competition, people touch things for me. Really? I've not wow. touched anything since two nights before Halloween. Don't touch, wow. don't drive, don't everything. People do things for me. So you don't, don't really have your feet on the ground anymore. Not at all, not no, at all. No, it's fantastic. Living the, dream. Haven't, living the dream. Haven't stopped. It's been unbelievable. So have you left Bolton behind now for good? Bolton? Yes. You're getting me confused with that, that comedian. I can't, Peter Kay. It doesn't make me laugh at all. You don't like he's Peter Kay? He's never been funny, funny, that lad, has he? No, makes us not. laugh. Makes I us don't, laugh. I don't rate him. I don't think mm. he's funny. Garlic bread and all that shenanigans. Peter, not Peter Kay was the comedian who made 100,000 people sway and dance at Live 8 just by playing the pan pipes. I well, he should... Them. Very talented. You know what he should do? What should he do? Over and over <laughs> and... If he did that, it'd make a lot of people happy. Yeah. Britain, it's... Geraldine's bringing the Xmas factor. Oh, see what I I've done? like the it. The Xmas factor back to Britain. Brilliant. That's what we want, you see. Okay. We, we look forward to it. Once Is that me done? Upon, <laughs> <laughs> once upon a Christmas To be honest, I think it's all of our careers I've never been on TVAM before. This is fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Anne Diamond? Where's we Anne Diamond? <laughs> she behind the tree. Come on out, Anne. <laughs> Come on, Adam Sander, later on. Yeah, go. All right. Hey, this will hey, mess with his head. Hey, will it? Lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you, too. Happy Christmas. Look at you. Happy Christmas to you, too. And good luck with the goat. Thank you very much. God Thank you. We've got a lovely apartment together now. It's great. Here we go. Okay. Ah! Oh. 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 Cut that out. Yeah. That's one of the slides. Yeah, we may, we may struggle to edit that. <laughs> Never mind. I'll be over here. I feel slightly faint. I don't know about anybody else. <laughs> oh, um, very, very still good. to come. You. Straight. You're so naughty. Straight from the red carpet. Hollywood superstar Adam Sandler with his own breasts. Thank goodness. Will be here. What do you think? <laughs> and what do you think he's making of all this? <laughs> and uh, take that, Gary, Yay! Howard, that. Mark, Jason, <laughs> chatting and performing after nine. See you later, Pete. Bye. Happy Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do a competition now. I don't want any nonsense from you, Geraldine. Today's your last chance before the weekend to give yourself an early Christmas present by winning £10,000. Here are the details.